Hello there, you beautiful you, and welcome to Teleforum. Game by Walter Martins, apparently. I'm not entirely sure what this game entails. All I know, it's a horror game. And it might be ARG. In any case, sit down, relax, enjoy the ride. We're gonna be experiencing this together for the first time. I don't know, I, I love... And by the way, this is a free game on Steam, I'm just saying. So, if you're interested in playing it, the, the link is going to be in the description down in the video. Okay, Juliana. Okay, this is the right building. Hey, you got a camera on? On now? <laughs> Let me remove the lens cover. There. Cameraman, okay, cameraman doesn't have a, a proper name. Right. It's it's best to have as much material as possible. We want the sixth floor. Uh, can you get the button? Probably. Okay, so this is just a square I click on. Oh, right. There it is. Sixth floor. What is it? You look like you have something to say. Don't you think it's wrong to bother a widow? I was just thinking about what happened. Did you get authorization for this? Well, I'm not in in a story, so I don't know what to say. Uh, I guess authorization. What are you talking about? Well, I don't know what I'm talking about. That's the point. They never approve of seeing sensationalist stories like this. You need to hand them the complete material, get it? If it is already done, it's harder for them to refuse it. Right. It was bizarre. You didn't see it, did you? No, I was reading uh, text prompts at the bottom of my screen. They just told me how it happened. What he used to, you know. You're lucky. I wish I hadn't seen it. Dot, dot, dot. You hear it, right? He gave Celso a VHS tape. The VT operator? Right. Celso was also supposed to broadcast the tape, but he couldn't. Technical issues. And bam, it happened. Oh, we're here. Come on. <clears throat> okay. Okay. We're going to apartment 608. Easy to remember. Oh. It's gonna be one of these, isn't it? Emergency stair, 6th floor. Go to the light side. To the light side? Head towards the trash bags. Uh, well, I found it right away. I think it's the apartment just ahead. Here we are. Well, let's get ready, shall we? You can film her getting the door and all that. So I should knock on the door, ring the bell. We'll look better on video. Ah, uh, ring the bell. I wonder if she's up to talking to strangers right now. I hope the camera doesn't act up during the interview. Uh, um... If she isn't, she'll be now. Let me try again. A little bit of both is always good. Is she even home? Say, did you work with Walter for long? What if she won't see us? Um, Ferreira called her right after it happened. I doubt she's left the house since yesterday. Alright. Third time's a charm. True. Oh. Oh my goodness, that, that picture in the corner there. What do you want? Adriana. Hi, Miss Miss uh, Martins. We're from Channel 8. We came to give you our condolences. Uh-huh, sure. 
yeah, a, a TV crew came personally with the cameras on to give their condolences to you. Yeah. Do you really need a video camera for that? That's what I said. We're making a special program about Walter. A homage. A kind of retrospective, you see. He worked at the station for so long. So we wanted to talk to you about him. About what happened. Right. Fine, come in. It might be a good to talk about it. <laughs> okay. Uh, quick thinker. Quick thinker, huh? Homage. I can't believe she bought that. Maybe she needs this now. Come on. Before she changes her mind. Why is she standing on the back there all creepy like? Yeah. Thank you again for welcoming um, for welcoming us, Mr. Martins. Hmm. Silva here will film our conversation, okay? Will he now? I have to think about that. What? Would you like to drink anything? Tea, coffee? Oh. I never refuse I never refuse a cup of coffee. That's true. That's true. Juliana is... She's, she's a smart woman. She's a smart woman. Unless your coffee's disgusting, lady, I'll be judging you very harshly. I'll go make some. Now, all that this reminds me... All this reminds me is that scene from IT 2. You know, the, the second IT movie. Where they go to the lady and then she's like, started acting all creepy in the background. She put a fast one on you, huh? Forget that. Let's snoop around while we have the chance. Make sure to get anything that catches your eye on camera. We're surrounded by material here. What is this thing? Oh, it's a chair. Yeah, what's that? Look, this is a certificate. Journalism degree from Uf UFRGS, specialization in communication. Walter was well educated. I think Miss Martins uh, is just the same. What a waste. Oh, it would be a shame if we only had shots of the same wall. Look around the whole room. Oh. Wow. I can actually turn around. Whoa, a VCR player. Fancy. How much is one of these going for now? Some two million Crusaders? Oh my god, this is that old? Okay, I just realized this is like a Brazilian game. They're like in the 80s or something here, aren't they? More than that, I think. Walter took a loan to pay for this. He told me uh, one time he gave me a ride. Huh. <laughs> is it going to rain today? Hardly. The rooster says otherwise. Look. Ah, these roosters never get it right. Yes, we can uh, we can use this to take to set the mood. Sure thing. Yes, this lady like it dark in here, huh? Look, a daily trophy. Oh, right. Walter got one of those uh, for an article he wrote back in the 70s. The station's owner uh, thought this would make us stand out more, but it didn't happen. Local stations have zero chance against the big ones. I think they uh, even had a lobby going on to rush this up. To hush this up. Uh, hey, I can hear her putting water in the filter. She's, she'll be back soon. Check out all you can now. Alright. Vaz. I remember Walter bought this raincoat and covers... Uh, I remember Walter bought this raincoat to cover a story. Some lake where it rains a lot or something. Right, the image got stuck in my head because he just vanished inside the thing. I remember he got cheated out of some 500 Crusaders for an oversized coat. He looked ridiculous in it, but he paid so much for the damn coat he just had to wear it. Poor guy. The plant is begging for water. It has been neglected for the past... For the pa for the little I guess it's been neglected for the last few days, considering all that happened.
There's a lot of books in this house. Anything interesting? Hmm. It is a book that doesn't quite fit here. Let me see. It's an it's an electronics manual. It's booked on a page about the cathode ray tube, the CRT. The pages are loose. She's still in there? Yeah. Okay. Keep the camera on. Look around some more. Okay. What's that? Oh, a dog. I thought it was a chair or something. The Poochie. Good one. We need a nice shot of gunpowder. Walter even carried a dog's uh, picture in his wallet. He showed it around as if he was a photo of his son. Coffee's almost done. Better be. Will you have one? Yes, thank you. Be my guest. So... Did you... <laughs> Sorry, I got distracted. Because uh, I saw the achievement. So, did you think it over? I did. Let's get this done with... Great. We'll begin shortly. Let's shoot the interview on that chair, Silva. Ready? No. But it doesn't matter. Okay. Let's go. Three, two, one. We're here with Mrs. Adriana Martins, wife of Walter Martins, our dear colleague who left us abruptly. She agreed to give us an interview during this most trying of times. The house itself really tells a story about how you two lived. Um, the award in the living room. Walter's raincoat. Uh, the award in the living room. Walter was a very highly celebrated... Uh, sorry. Walter was a very high caliber professional working at a small station. Would you like to comment on that? He felt he had less problems with higher ups when working at a small station. He could suggest topics, be more hands on. He also believed in keeping local stations alive. We lived well. He wasn't an ambitious man, not in that sense. He was a good man. Um, many of Walter's things are still around. He has been thinking about selling the apartment. Because of, uh, of everything. These things are just, these things just make it all more difficult. I'm thinking of getting rid of everything. It's hell. Gunpowder. What's been getting you through these difficult times? Gunpowder. He helped me more than anything else. The dog? Of course. He's been quite sad. He knows something's amiss. He misses Walter. At least taking care of him has taken my mind off things. Walter was an avid reader. What had he been reading this past few days? He'd walk around the house with some manual or something in hands. An electronics manual, I think. He kept missing around he kept mess He kept messing around with the VCR. He kept messing around with the VCR. I noticed because he even stopped reading the papers. Look, I'm sorry. I don't think I can keep going. Of course, Miss Martins. We have enough material already. He was so different, so nervous. I never expected him to. No, no one expects that, Miss Martins. I still can't even imagine Walter's handing... I still can't even imagine Walter's handling a gun. Gun? What gun? Walter never had a gun. The... The gun, the... The one he used during the show's broadcast. He did not use a gun. I know it was horrible, but I saw it when he pulled the trigger. That's... What Ferreira told uh, you back at the station, right? No, I was told he used the knife. S Wait, why am I choosing for her now? Uh, I don't know. I just choose. I wonder how. I wonder how this affects the the telling of the story. 
What? How can that be? My god. I knew it. Ever since he got that damn tape. The tape he tried to broadcast? Celsus examined the tape, but back at the studio. I think the film was burned. Something like that. That wasn't the tape. Not the original one. That was a copy. Seriously? Do we still have the original one? Yes, here. I don't know what he saw in this thing, and I don't know where he got it from. Walter made me swear to never watch it. He only watched it when I wasn't home, or in ones, or in the small hours of the morning. You want to watch it, don't you? For a show. I don't think it's a good idea, but I'm too tired to try and change your mind. I... I'm going outside to have a smoke. I don't even want to hear this thing. Fair enough. So we're just gonna sit here in this... Ooh, that's not good. I, I, dis I dislike that, bigly. This is it, we have quite a story here. You look like you've seen a ghost. You s you'll stay, right? Yeah, just gotta see what the hell is going on here. Are you crazy? I'm out. Ah, I guess, guess I gotta see it. I knew I made the right decision in bringing you with me. Okay. This is how I do it. You feel me as I watch the thing. Alright, quite sure that's going to work out wonderfully for all parties, and we are not going to, um, we are not going to, uh, be cursed or anything. We have more takes that way. We can insert the tape's content in the video during the, during editing. Don't. You're lacking common sense. Oh, right. Right, let's make some room here. Alright, let's begin. Let's get my first impressions on film. We can fix it all on editing later. There. I'll press play. It's starting. What is this place? I don't recognize this building. The symbols. I... I can almost... Do they mean anything to you? Looking at, they, looking at them making my head hurt. Gives me deja vu. I feel like I'm, I can almost understand them. Neither of this. No. Deja vu. Uh, I guess. But at the same time, I can't... It feels like they get entangled inside their brain. Oh, it changed. Good. So, did he go inside the building? What is this place? Looks like a prison. Looks like a shopping mall. Looks like a museum. Looks like a school. Just from looking at it, it doesn't look like any of these. I would imagine it would be more... I don't know. Prison shape, but n neither one of them, actually. Prison. Inside the cells. Are those... Are those people? He's just walking by everything. What sort of building is this? It's way too long. Look. There's someone up ahead. Uh-oh. That guy. He looks like... He looks... He looks like what? Did you get that? I'll turn up the volume. I mean, you don't have to. I can hear it perfectly. Chard, take my hand. We'll take a walk. Get to zero inside the Lost Ark. I'll buy you the sky. Sounds like it mentioned someone named Oscar. Ska. We're assuming control. Ska. Someone named Oscar? I don't. I can't hear anything about Oscar. I can't understand the damn thing. Let me turn up the volume some more. You don't have to. It's already loud enough. Okay. 
and then it ended. You okay? That's it. I'm turning this thing off. I had it. I'm out of here. And then she turns her head 360 style, uh, like, you know, exorcist. Com Community TV. Commercial break? Right. Community TV. 8 p.m. Scene 8. For drama. Zero reporter. Right. Okay, we're in the right building. Is the camera on? Oh. What happened? Oh, I'm doing it again. Let me get... Let me get the button. Oh, it's going fast. You look like you've seen a ghost. Yeah. Uh, it's just some deja vu. Right. So I start the game, but I'm already in a loop. Well, I'm, I'm actually curious now. I went to the flashback side. Head directly to 6... Oh. Directly to 608. There's the apartments. Finally. So it's... I'll do the talking. So... It's not a perfect loop, it's... Good evening. Oh. We're from Channel 8, we came to talk to you about what happened. Do you mind if we record this, right? I... You want to talk about water, right? The recent events? Everything st is stuck in your throat, isn't it? Whoa. Come in. It might be good to... It might be good to speak to someone. Hey, aren't you coming on a little too strong? Yeah, there is. That's what we're... Let me find out. Come on, get in. Beyond the edge of your consciousness. We're about to begin. You... Uh, tea, coffee? No, thanks. Well, we'll go make something anyways. Oh, the dog is up now. No. Let's just... God damn it. We'll have to wait for her. Oh, I'll have a look around here. Yeah, whatever. She's not doing so good, is she? Yeah, the dog's awake now. Hey, gunpowder. He seems a little nervous and easy. Or is he afraid? Certificates. Walter wasn't a complete dumbass, unlike some people back at the studio. Right. But I don't recognize any of these institutions. Something is happening to her. So many books. Hmm. Huh. There's one missing. The manual book is missing? Oh, it's a different thing now. It's a crow. Eliforum. Roll credits. Something about this TV set gives me the creeps. Hey, there's a weird thing hanging above the front door. Look. Go there and take it off. Take it off? Looks like it's going to rain after all. Funny. We had a clear sky the whole day. I'll get there when I get there, lady. Now that's a blurry photo. Looking at it gives me the vertigo. There. Let's get to the point. Walter uh, took a tape to the studio. But it wasn't the original one, was it? The original one is here, with you. How do you know that? We examined the one we had with him. I want to see the original. Well, yes. 
I have it here. Do you know where he's found this tape? Is this why you came here? Had I known, I would have never opened the door. Here, take it. I don't want to see this thing. I'll go have a smoke outside. Tell me when you're done. But you won't, will you? Do you want to shoot at the video today? But hey, she's a widow. What's gotten into you? I don't have time for this. But, fine, you're right. This whole thing is making me empty. You know what? Why don't you check up on her? Even better, interview her. You always wanted to do that, right? Here's your chance. See if she's up to answering some questions about the origin of the tape. Okay, we have some different occurrences. There she is. Deep breaths. What is this smell? It's not a cigarette. No, focus. If I do a good job, um, I might get new opportunities. I can help Mrs. Martins feel a little better. I'll probably change nothing, but I still want to do it. Yeah. I'm doing it just for, just for myself, am I not? Ms. Martins? What is it? Are you done? Not yet. Juliana is watching the, the tape. Meanwhile, I want to ask you some, some questions. For your program? Shouldn't the girl be asking the, be asking the questions? Yeah, but she's busy with the tape. Yes, they put it for me. Actually, I got care. I got worried about you, ma'am. That's true. I've never seen many people like that girl in this line of work. I've seen many. Because of Walter. People who stop at nothing, eh? Fine. Let's do this interview of yours. You'd better think very carefully about the questions of yours. My head's about to burst. Normal, just like any other day. He spent so much time watching that thing, but his behavior was the same. He was uneasy, but I never thought it would come down to this. I'm not, I'm not sure you've seen it, but he left a note. I only noticed minutes after it had already happened. The only strange thing that day was he made a copy of the tape. Um, do you know where the tape come from? No, we need to investigate this. I think he got it at a, I think he got it at home, but I didn't see who delivered it. Walter collect, collected movies, hard to film, hard to find films, recordings. I thought it was just another one. Just thinking about that girl alone in my living room, watching that thing, makes my skin crawl. Yeah, same. Say, why is she so interested in the tape? To tell the truth, so am I. Because it is an important piece of, of this case. Um, I don't think it's important, we don't even know. We just came across th that fact. <laughs> of course, the copy ended up being a blank, right? Or it got burned, I'm not sure. I can see how this would... <laughs> I can see how this would entice you. It's a mystery, after all. But... Don't you think that colleague of yours is acting a little strange? Yes. I... I could swear I've seen her before. To be honest, I had a feeling I've seen you before as well. Maybe I've never seen her... Maybe I've seen her at the studio. I'm not sure. I don't think so. I haven't been working there for long. Hmm. Maybe that's why you don't seem to like her. Not yet, anyway. Me? Yes. Why are you in this, anyways? Well, this is my job. I don't get picked... I don't get picked my tasks. Uh, can we conclude this interview first? No. No. We can't. You came here. I didn't call anybody. I have the right to ask my questions. You know? I get it. I get the idea of moving up the ladder. The allure of a sensationalist piece of news. You can see it too, can't you? Nothing good come came from this tape. From this whole thing. 
It really didn't cause anything positive until now. That's precisely why we need to investigate. Do we really need to? Is, is it really the search for truth that motivates the story you're working on? Or is it something else? And if something else, then wouldn't then it wouldn't be right. I I want to know. Is it that's the reason it's necessary? At least you're being honest. Look, I've got a splitting headache. Go check if she's done, then leave, please. I want my living room back. Thank you for the interview. Well, here we go. Hey, Juliana. Are you okay? Are you okay in there? Oh, we don't even get to see what's inside. We don't even get to see what happened to her. Another commercial break. Do you understand? I got a, an achievement saying that. No. No, I don't. Oh? Ooh. I need to reach the apartment. Reach the apartment? Why are you going on the stairs for? The apartment. Sorry, what? Oh, Max Headroom? <laughs> I, I don't know. I, I would imagine no, because apparently this is a Brazilian game. We would have our own creepypastas down here. Okay, the apartment. Dot, dot, dot. Which apartment? Six. Oh. I can choose? Oh. Well, I mean, I'm gonna choose the correct one. I don't know if choosing anything changes anything. I bet it does, which will require multiple plays of this game. I'm just gonna go straight, straight forwards. Yes, that was it. I had uh, someone else with me. Ju... Jul... Juliana. How could I forget her? Your colleague's name stays in your mind. I don't even know if the is if it's picking up. Yeah, it's picking up the achievements too. How could I forget her? Each step makes it harder to remember. That tape. What I saw in, what I saw in it, I watched an unrecorded, unrecorded nightmare. It was seeing and forgetting the name of what I saw. I saw the past. Of a future that never happened. I uh, unrecorded nightmare, I guess. And it was not recorded. And if it was not recorded, oh. Can I ever awake from it? The apartment. Just stay there. I'm just keep I'm just getting like achievement after achievement. Better to record everything. Everything can be can be used. Oh. Let's look at the window first. I need to go on. Is this the right way? Oh. I don't know. I need to pay attention. Alright. The sound. Do I really want to follow it? I guess. What is this door? Is this where she was? The door won't budge. But there's a grate. I don't want to see what's in there. I need it to see what's in there. Yeah. It doesn't look so good. That woman. I... Do I know her? Why am I tearing up like this? There is no... It's no use. There is nothing else I can do here. Weird smell here. Where did I smell... Where did I smell this before?
Uh. Uh. Keep going. I don't know. Keep going. Oh, the Gucci. Gunpowder? What happened here? Hang on, let me do a. Let me do a little uh, change on something here. There we go. Why why is the dog here? Where's your owner, huh? Hey, gunpowder. Where's your owner? Am I imagining things or is the dog avoiding the apartment? Oh no. Not now, come on. Yeah. Gunpowder. Come back here. What's gotten into him? He just dashed down the hall. Looks like he was lined up with some some note. Inspect the note. It's a note. Yeah, that's what you said. I've had it. And did what I shouldn't. Now, I have an unending nightmare in my brain. In an endless loop. With no chance of escape. And what scares, the, what scares me the most? It's not much worse than the life I left behind. If anyone reads this, don't leave gunpowder alone. Just, just also, these letters are giving me vertigo. Wait, the dog. Where did the dog go? Go after him. Gunpowder? I'm going inside. I'm going. I need to. Well, gotta go get the dog. Yes, go after the dog. And it's awful. Say it out loud. The camera carries me. Not the other way around. I can't even tell when this started. Perhaps a long time ago. Maybe when I submitted my application. Gunpowder? I'm going in. Go after gunpowder. It's not the apartment anymore. Well, oh, and I can even imagine that pretty much all of this is like a just like a three D environment with a, with like a very good filter to make it look like you know this eighties style of footage, right? Walter Martins, okay, the telephone. Caros telespectadores, boa noite. Steamed viewers, good night. Hoje nós teremos I guess I don't have to read that. Transmissão especial do nosso programa. Possivelmente a minha última. E com ela trago um comunicado a fazer para todos vocês. Descobri algo nas últimas semanas que tem tem me assombrado desde então. Palavras não serão o bastante para descrever o que descobri. Portanto, eu vou precisar mostrar. E talvez isso venha assombrar vocês, assim como tem me assombrado. Mas a minha profissão, o meu trabalho, foi revelar a verdade durante todos esses anos. E se quisermos nos libertar, preciso que todos saibam disso que tenham mostrado. Por isso, eu acho que todos estão bem dentro dos aparelhos. Não cruzem suas pernas, isso é importante. Mas fiquem confortáveis com a coluna reta. Exclusive property, in case you are not part of the crew, deliver it. Okay. Okay, so there is more things to... There are more things to find. Um, how long have I been recording? About 40 minutes. Alright, so I'm gonna do it like this. If... Uh, if this video performs marginally okay, and then my, in, for my channel standards, that is... Um, I'll do another part, finding the rest, because it's already 40 minutes. If I'm going to 
lightly edited the video just to take out some of the points where maybe I wasn't saying anything or that I was just like uh maybe I, like I made some horrible mistakes while reading something that I, I it's going to reduce it by like I don't know, maybe like a minute or two so anyway so if you would like to see more which to me it's it's very interesting this is a free game by the way you can find it in the description of the video uh, and if you're liking this and would like to see more, then please, like the video. That's going to be one of the few metrics that I'm going to use to um, evaluate the performance of the, of the interest in to seeing more. Um, don't forget to subscribe if you enjoy my content and ring the bell so don't miss out the notifications. Uh, whenever I'm streaming next, whenever I'm playing, whenever I upload the next part of this, if it comes about. With that said... Thank you so much, you beautiful you, for watching and getting to the end of the video. Hopefully, I'll be seeing you in the next one. Bye-bye.